Kentucky Folk Art Center is the official repository in the state of Kentucky for folk art from every corner of the state. On our first floor, we exhibit pieces from our permanent collection of more than 1,500 works made by folk artists, primarily from Kentucky. Upstairs, we do changing exhibitions. The Kentucky Folk Art Center also hosts numerous cultural events throughout the year, like a Day in the Country Folk Art Fair and the Holiday Arts and Crafts Fair. We uh, offer a comprehensive educational outreach program that served more than 100,000 public school students over the past eight years. Kentucky Folk Art Center is an asset to Moorhead State University because we offer something that very few other universities can offer, which is a fully functioning, professionally staffed art museum. And students who want to have internships, part-time student workers, they can get experiences here that they can't get anywhere else. We talk to tons and tons of university classes about both arts, Appalachian culture, arts administration, all of those things. And uh, most universities can't offer that, that sort of thing to their students. Our student workers play a very valuable role here at the Kentucky Folk Art Center. They run the front desk, they help us with exhibitions. Uh, a lot of the students who work with us have the desire to go on uh, to pursue a career in, muse in museums somewhere. Uh, it's an interesting field and we, this is the only place they can get that type of experience. It's kind of neat because most people don't know about the Kentucky Folk Art Center, so being able to connect what the students are learning in their classroom to what we offer here uh, is great because they learn about it there, but then they have initiative to come here and actually see it in person. We've been able to reach uh, students through summer camp in the community. We've done public school um, art workshops, professional development for teachers, um, and we've gone further out to work with teachers in their classrooms. It's always neat because we have such a variety of artwork uh, that you probably won't see in, in some of the other museums. It's very unique to this uh, region and to the culture. So when kids come in here and they get to see really colorful uh, pieces of artwork that are vibrant and, and different, they really connect to that. I think a lot of people that come in the door, they're expecting traditional crafts and what we deal with is contemporary folk art. So it's, it's always a really great reaction because they're like, oh, I didn't know this was this is what I was going to be seeing today. They were expecting baskets or uh, handcrafted chairs or something, which we've also done, but that's not what we do on the regular basis. So we're the only art museum in Appalachian, Kentucky. We're also one of only a handful of art museums in America focused on self-taught art, and we're the only one that focuses on self-taught art from one state or region. Most of our visitors come from outside the region. Uh, one, of, one of our great desires is to see more people from inside the region come to the Kentucky Folk Art Center. It's free, the art is accessible, a lot of it is stuff that people from our region are going to relate to and appreciate. And, you know, I, I'd like to see us, rather than having 95% of our visitation be from outside the region, I'd love to see our visitation tick up to the point where we had 20 or 25 percent of our annual visitors come from inside the region. However, saying that, most of the school groups that visit us are uh, schools from this region, and we'll have two or three thousand students a year come through. Uh, so so we do it, we're trying to build an audience in the next generation. I really appreciate every every time someone says that they really enjoyed the stay here. We always try to talk to everyone that comes in and make sure that they feel welcomed and if they have any questions about the art, we're, we're always happy to um, help them understand what it is that the people were coming from to be able to create this amazing artwork here because we have such a vast variety of artists and they're all self-taught but in so many different ways they are able to uh, create and express their emotions through art. The Kentucky Folk Art Center is an excellent investment because we, we help generate pro probably two million dollars in e economic activity in the region 
when you count in the folk art fairs and the craft fairs and all of those sorts of things that we do. The Kentucky Folk Art Center is a leading edge of Moorhead State University. We introduce the university to thousands of people all over the country each year who would, who would otherwise never hear about us. Currently we're working on big projects in Nashville, Lexington, Columbus. We'll be those people's first introduction to Moorhead State.